Every organization is unique, and that's why in many cases you'll need custom agents. But that doesn't mean you have to build from scratch. Okay, but how can I really customize my agents when I'm using pre-existing Gen AI models? Is just adding some tooling and reasoning loop logic enough? Well, kind of. That will already start to make a huge difference. There's one type of tooling that we haven't discussed as deeply yet that made a huge difference in the world of generative AI. All right, are you talking about RAG, Retrieval Augmented Generation? Sure am. Before RAG, Gen AI models were static knowledge bases. Meaning their knowledge was limited to what was available in the training data? Yeah, and once trained, the knowledge base didn't dynamically update with new information and needed additional training or fine tuning. Meaning you could get outdated or irrelevant results or results that weren't quite specific to your organization. Right, and even though pre-RAG agents might have used tools, they weren't using those tools to process and learn from the data the tools provided. Then came RAG creating a system where the model can retrieve and learn from data provided by tools. Got it, so if you want solutions that truly make a difference, you want your agent to be processing and learning from your company's data. Yeah, so in this lesson, we go through how agents with RAG systems use tooling and what types of tooling they use. Ready to learn? Let's dive in.